June 1, 2022, New York, New York, USA, New York Rangers center Mika Zabanajad, 93, celebrates his goal against the Tampa Bay Lightning with left-wing Chris Kreider, 20, and defenseman Adam Fox, 23, in the third period of Game 1 of the Eastern Conference Final of the 2022 Stanley Cup Playoffs at MAD. Mandatory credit, Danny Wild USA Today Sports No Quit in New York isn't just a marketing campaign, it's a state of mind adopted by every New York Rangers players this season. They were down 3-1 in their first round series against the Pittsburgh Penguins and won that. They were down 2-0, then 3-2 versus the Carolina Hurricanes before taking it in seven games. The fact that this team is 2-2 against the defending Stanley Cup champions with two out of three at home should be confidence boosting. However, outside of the Rangers locker room there's a sense that by not winning either games 3 or 4 in Tampa this is now the Lightning series to take. New York Rangers confident heading to Game 5 it's not easy, but we can't be sad, Artemi Panarin said. For sure it's not going to help us. Try to be positive. We have to be positive. We've been in a worse spot before, so we're okay. I hope we do well in the garden. Our fans, nice to see you again. Try to do something more. Yes, the series shifts to Madison Square Garden where the blue shirts are 8-1 to in these playoffs. Matter of fact, they're undefeated on home ice after dropping Game 1 to the Penguins in triple overtime. The New York Rangers have had a positive outlook throughout the season and nothing has changed here in June. They're back-to-back -back Stanley Cup champions and we are in the Eastern Conference Final playing a really good team, Jacob Truba said. I don't think we expected to walk in here and blow the doors off the thing. This is competitive hockey. These are going to be hard games. It's a best of three and that's something to be pretty excited about as a group. We're in a pretty good spot here. Newcomer Andrew Akop, who has been moved to center for an injured Ryan Strom is also feeling confident. We're probably in the best spot we've through three series with two games at home, he said. I think we play really good at home. I think we're all confident with where we're at right now but there needs to be an increased level of desperation. Rangers on what they need to do better June 5, 2022, Tampa, Florida, USA, Tampa Bay Lightning Center Anthony Cirelli, 71, New York Rangers Center Mika Zabanajad, 93, and Tampa Bay Light. Mandatory credit, Kim Clement USA Today Sports One thing that the Rangers identified immediately after their Game 4 loss was their inability to make life tough on Andrei Vasilevsky, 